Hello everyone, I'm Val from Mike and Val's Life and today I am participating in the Fall Thrift Store Flip. This is being hosted by Tracy of the Holiday Cookie Diva. Now in this challenge you go to Goodwill or any thrift store and you find something that you can come home, clean, repair, paint, whatever you need to do to flip this to make it useful for your home decor and for fall. Now let me show you what I purchased. This is what I purchased and I really like this little girl. She really goes with the theme I have going right now. And the, I know and it says winter welcome. That there is where I'm going to have to to change all of that. First, I'm going to have to clean her up. Boy, I don't know what she's been in, but she needs a good little cleaning. Uh, now, it has $4.99 on the back, but this was a half off, so I got this for $2.50. I'm going to, off camera, I'm going to clean her up, and then I'll come back after I've, taken, I've cleaned her uh, and, and take this off, where because this is what I'm going to work on. So, I will be back in a few. Okay, now I've cleaned her up pretty good. I've taken all of everything off of this. Uh, it was really nasty. Here's all that stuff, but I've got her cleaned. Now I'm going to work on this part. Now what I'm going to do here, I took this off. But I'm going to reuse this. I'm going to sand this down some. And then I'm going to paint it this uh, cashew color. This chalkboard cashew color. Or chalk paint. I keep calling it chalkboard. The chalk paint. Some sandpaper. I'm going to go clean this up, wash it down, and I'll be back. Now, I'm going to get some of this uh, cashew chalk paint, and I'm going to paint this little metal panel that goes on the, the little sun. Okay, now I'm going to let this dry, and I will probably do another coat of, of this, and then we're going to, I'm going to add the word autumn to it. So I'll be back in a little bit. Okay, now while I'm waiting for the paint to dry, I went ahead and I, this... They have the little girl holding a spool of thread. So I went ahead and took that out. And what I'm planning on using, is I got this pick. Now, I think this one came from Walmart. If it didn't, it came from Dollar Tree or Walmart, but I think this one was a Walmart one. But it does have this little pumpkin that I think would be cute for her to be holding. So... I'm just going to go ahead and clip this off. Put that over there. 
that way. She could be holding a little pumpkin. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to use glue sticks or glue dots. I'm sorry, I'm going to use glue dots and my E6000. First I'm going to put a glue dot some E6000. Like that. So next, I'm still waiting on the this to dry. So I will be back in a few when that is it won't be long it, it's almost dry now okay now my sign is dry hello oh, thank you and I've stenciled out the word autumn and that's what I am going to use here uh, I did it on paper to see how I needed to place it so I could get it right, make sure that the letters would work and everything. So as this is a somewhat of a template, I'm going to go ahead and with a pencil put the word autumn. Then I will go back with a, a paint with a thin paint a real thin paintbrush, outline it and then paint in the middle with in the words in the in the letters keep the fingers crossed that this works Okay, now I have the word autumn. I wish I had went just a little bit further this way, but I'm going to add a few things on here so I can make it work. Well, it's gotten a little late on me, but I'm bound to determine to get through tonight. I had to wait uh, for autumn to dry, the words autumn, and then I did a second, after it finally dried, I did a second coat. But we are just about on our way to being through. So, this is what we have now. Now let's get through. I am going to add a little metal plate here. Once again, I am going to use the old glue dots to keep it down good as I, while the uh, E6000 dries. Well, I guess I won't finish it tonight. I am going to have, I'm going to press this down, let it stay overnight, but we will see. If this works, I will finish this in the morning. If it doesn't, it will have to be tomorrow afternoon. I will see y'all then. 
Let me put this on here. Okay, now it's morning, and oh, thank goodness, that worked out great with the E6000 and putting something heavy on it. It is on there really good now. So now I am going to finish embellishing it, and I will be through. Now, I got these little leaves. These are just some from Dollar Tree that I, I've used all over, but... Uh, I'm going to put a few on here, just like one here, and maybe one here. Get that. And while I was thinking about doing this, I went to into my little stash, and I found these little acorns. Now. I don't know when I bought these. It must have been about six or seven years ago, but that was the first time for me to ever use them, so it's, the package is brand new. I got in it, and the good thing on these is that they're flat on the back, so they're perfect to put on something like this. And I'm sure they're from Hobby Lobby. And they probably were a clearance since I never used them, and... A really good clearance. I'll buy stuff. If it's cheap enough, I'll buy it. So I may need that one day. Well, today's the day, huh? Now, the one thing I did keep, well, two things. I did keep the little plaque thing, the little metal thing, but the other thing was the bow, because it does match her little hat and everything. And the, the colors, I'm sorry, the air conditioner came on, but the colors are good, I still think, for fall. So I'm going to leave this, and I'm going to add the bow back on it. I went and I found one of these little flowers. Now she didn't have anything right here, or if she did at one time, she didn't have it after I mean, when I purchased her. I'm going to add just a little flower right here, a little. Just give her a little more the fall look. So now, this is what she looks like now. I think she turned out beautiful. She went from a, a winter to autumn. And I think everything really looks good. I'm, I'm really uh, pleased. Now, I'll go hang her on the wall so you can see what she looks like there. And now I want to show you what she looks like on the wall. I think she really turned out really good. I am super pleased with her. And once again, I want to thank Tracy for making this an open challenge. I had so much fun participating. And I want to thank each and every one of you who's joined me today to let me share the DIY with you. I hope everyone has a great day. May God bless. Bye-bye.